Samsung is ready to unleash a new fan edition phone on the Android market. It will be available in select regions starting this week, and I'm ready to share my first impressions. From the first moment, we were surprised by the elevated build quality. The phone uses Samsung's design language for 2023 to the full extent, but it's a few steps above the Galaxy A54. It uses flagship-grade materials, including an aluminum frame, and it feels sturdier, partly because it is heavier than previous FE handsets. Overall, the Galaxy S23 FE feels like a premium Android phone. It pairs a Gorilla Glass Victus display with an aluminum frame that promises to put up with daily life. The high-end display and frame add a comfortable heft to the device, putting it a class above the similarly styled Galaxy A54 5G. Leading up to the Galaxy S23 Fan Edition unveiling, social media platforms have been buzzing with criticism aimed at Samsung for using the Exynos 2200 SoC, which doesn't have the best reputation. But we're happy to report that the Exynos-powered Galaxy S23 FE unit Sam Mobile used for roughly one week works surprisingly well. The Galaxy S23 Fan Edition offers a smooth one UI experience with no hiccups whatsoever, and it gives us the impression that Samsung fixed whatever used to be wrong with the Exynos 2200 SoC last year. Of course, if you buy the Galaxy S23 FE in a Qualcomm-specific market, you'll get the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1's SoC, which should be even better. But even if you don't, the Exynos 2200 chip seems to be doing its job well, especially considering that our pre-release unit runs on older firmware. One last thing worth knowing is that the Galaxy S23 Fan Edition offers a solid camera experience complete with features such as 2x portrait cropping, mintography, and a full-fledged director's view. Oh, and the phone will receive four OS upgrades up to Android 17. Samsung says the Galaxy S23 FE will go live in select markets on October 5 for $599. Buyers can choose from four standard color options, mint, cream, graphite, and purple and two online exclusive colors, indigo and tangerine. So long as Samsung can check the right boxes, it's easy to see the Galaxy S23 FE standing as a solid alternative to the flagship lineup. It has the camera's battery capacity, software commitment needed to keep you moving, and a $599 price tag that won't break the bank even without carrier deals. Would you buy the Samsung Galaxy S23 FE? I'd love to know your thoughts in the comment section. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.